TreeStuff.com Tech Tips presents using a targeted vertical speed line. A targeted VSL uses gravity and a tensioned rope to guide a falling object to a specific point on the ground. By tensioning a rope between the tree you are working on and another fixed point, you can, using a midline knot, float the target away from various hazards. The speed line rope is then anchored under the cut, run through a link at the target, and to a friction management device set out of the drop zone. A porter wrap, figure eight, or a rigging prusik all work depending on the size of the rigging. In our example, the logs are cut halfway, the tether sling is attached to the log and the speed line. The speed line is tightened and locked off, the cut is finished, and then the log is pushed off. This vertical speed line easily allowed us to direct heavy logs away from a house, wires, and a steep hillside avoiding negative blocking and almost all strain and impact on the rigged spar. With logs weighing in excess of eight to 900 pounds, this was a great benefit. Using a vertical speed line allows you the ease of bombing material out with the security of much more stressful rigging. The logs in our situation could have easily bounced 10 to 20 feet in any direction upon hitting the ground. Notice the reliable path and travel of each log as it falls to the ground and strikes in the target area. A few half inch to 5 eighths inch stable braid eye slings, a cow hitch, and some steel rigging carabiners pair with your existing rigging lines and hardware to make an excellent vertical speed line kit. Thanks for watching this edition of TreeStuff.com Tech Tips. Remember to hit the like button or subscribe for more content.